Fox Across America host Jimmy Fallon is here. Crime and no punishment, whether you're an adult, and especially if you're under the age of 18. Yeah, for real, but we should commend Eric Adams for leaving the nightclub for five minutes to talk about this. I mean, he's such a dirtbag mayor in that. Like every liberal mayor in the country, they're outsourcing the end result of their leadership. You know what I'm saying? This is not outside agitators. When he cites things like M80s, first of all, fireworks are going off at every hour of the day in the city. Like if you live uptown, it's the 4th of July, like year round. Oh, fun. So, no, I know it's sad, but that is just the reality. That being said, this is clearly a byproduct of bad parenting and bad leadership. And I'm just wondering if I was booked because I represent both. Well, you, well, that could be it. Uh, but also, I mean, what it, happened here? He says you can't raise your kids on social media. Uh -huh. He doesn't go to the next step to go. Well, who is supposed to raise the kids then, Mary yeah. Adams? Mm -hmm. Families. Yeah. Uh, parents. Both parents in the home would be helpful. Yes. But you know, you're an expert on this next topic, and I want to get your take on it because I know <laughs> you ahead. scream and I scream and we all scream. Yeah. Oh, do we ever? For ice cream, but apparently the nostalgic ice cream trucks are too much for New York City lawmakers who want them to get rid of. Uh, the gas. So to him, this one lawmaker who's introduced this bill, he's forcing these truck owners to fork over thousands of dollars, five thousand dollars worth of changes to their trucks. That's not a problem. He acknowledges the nearly five thousand dollar cost to switch to electric uh, or solar power, uh, and he says that he's going to offer a bit of optimism. Costs will likely decrease as electric and solar generators become more widely adopted and will be less expensive to operate than gas guzzling generators. You love ice cream. I love ice cream. Is this a good move? Because I hate this. Let them. Yeah. Let them. Let them go with diesel. Yeah. Oh, I wouldn't care what they went with. First of all, where, who is passing going to get the cost of this? The consumer. So you're going to be buying a thirty-one dollar ice cream sandwich. You know what exactly. I'm saying? It's always stupid, and it never addresses the real problem of pollution in the city. It's not ice cream trucks. Okay. Do you know when you go into the Midtown Tunnel? It's always traffic. In the Midtown Tunnel, we have a bike lane. Okay, that has to go green before you get to turn into the Midtown Tunnel, which backs traffic up about 35 blocks so one guy can ride by on a bicycle. Like, screw you, Sean Duffy. Not you, but them. But Mayor Adams. Yeah, yeah, thank you. And that legislator. Thank you. But that's what this guy is worried about. Ice cream trucks. <laughs> and not these marauding mobs of no, people. No, no, no. Who, who, by the way, went into a CVS nearby and grabbed bottles of water. Not only were they looting the CVS, they were grabbing bottles of water and beating the customers in the head with them. There's so much of that mob mm -hmm. and that riot that the video didn't even catch. Well, it's the climate change causing these riots. You need to know that. He's just trying to help you out. Always bringing wisdom and insight, Jimmy. Stop Thank it. you. Ice cream. He you didn't know. laugh at your Riders. joke, though. I didn't need him to. It's okay. <laughs> I'm strong on was, the inside. I laughed inside. <laughs> <laughs> Love you much.